of course, our friend from Fern. Now, hi, Shao. Hello, Shao. Okay, before we get to the next product that you're going to dazzle us with, do you have any idea what Chef Jack is making tonight? Um, actually, okay, I'll give you a wild guess. Okay. Is it about a bar? It is, actually. Okay, um, is it butterscotch bars? You're hanging out with us too much, because that's right. She's going to make really? butterscotch bars tonight. Yes. I was browsing through her recipe earlier, mm -hmm. and I, I noticed that uh, there's salt in her recipe. Now, salt is something that comes up a lot when we bake. Yep. And, you know, I, in the beginning, I was like, why are we putting something salty into something that is ultimately going to be sweet? Okay. Can you tell us what salt does exactly when you add it into a dessert recipe? Okay, Sam. Um, actually, cakes and desserts, we cannot call the sweets without sugar, right? Mm -hmm. As the salt, it will balance its sweetness and the flavor. Mm -hmm. And also, as a preservative, it will inhibit the growth of some microorganism in our recipe. Oh! Yes, for cakes and other desserts. Okay. As, aside from the preservatives that we put to prolong its shelf life, so salt acts also as a preservative. Oh, right. As for Chef Jackie's recipes, butterscotch bars, um, when when she will add um, for an iodized salt, it will definitely balance its sweetness, so it will not be too sweet. Mm -hmm. And also, definitely, it will extend its shelf life using the iodized salt. Okay. I think I will be aware of all of that mm -hmm. when um, I taste Chef Jackie's butterscotch bars. But of course, she has to make it first. So, Sh Chef Jackie, how's it going? I'm fine. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. Actually, for today, uh, I'm not just going to use Ferna Iodized Salt. Marami akong gagamitin products ng Ferna for this butterscotch bar. This is perfect for giveaways. And of course, talagang pag uh, Christmas time, hit na hit ito para sa mga like people like us na who sell uh, baked goods for a living. Okay, so first thing that we have to do is melt the butter and the sugar. This is light brown sugar. This is half a cup of butter and one cup of light brown sugar. We'll just melt it together over low heat. Okay, so while I'm waiting for this, let me introduce you to my friends. Okay, this is, uh, of course, the Ferna iodized salt. And then I'm also going to be using the baking powder of Ferna, the Ferna Primera baking powder. And... Uh, the vanilla powder. Actually, I, uh, we've seen us use the vanilla clear and the vanilla liquid. Pero this is the first time that we're going to use the vanilla powder uh, in true confections. So let's just wait until my butter melts. Okay, while I'm waiting for that, okay, let me combine one teaspoon of my Ferna Primera baking powder with my one cup of all-purpose flour and then I have here the Ferna iodized salt. That's just my dry ingredients. Yeah. So now, nagmelt na yung aking uh, butter and sugar. Okay, I don't want my mixture to be so hot when I add my eggs. So ito transfer ko siya. Then I'll add my eggs. Just two eggs. Yeah. Excuse me. Okay, and then from this point, hahalo ko na the rest of the ingredients. These are my dry ingredients. And then yung aking uh, Ferna Primera baking powder and yung iodized salt and of course the all-purpose flour. It's going to be a nice, gooey paste. Now, butterscotch is really part of Christmas because it's the smell of the uh, the sugar caramelizing. Kasama siya sa Pasko. Pag naaamoy niyo siya, alam niyo Christmas na. That's why this is a nice giveaway. Yeah. Anyway, to make it extra special, I have the Franklin Baker Tender Flakes Coconut. That's half a cup, and then walnuts. It's so one-fourth cup. You mix it in, and then lalagyan nyo na sa 8 by 8 na baking pan. Now, this baking pan has been greased on the side, and then in the bottom, I put a piece of paper. Okay, yung greaseproof paper para mabilis siyang tanggalin. 
Okay, so put it, put your batter in. Okay, so spread it. Okay, and remember when you're making bars, ito naman ang tip ko para sa inyo. Just make sure that you put on the corners. Kasi usually, people forget to spread all the way to the corners. So, ang nangyayari, pag hindi nalalagyan ng corners, ang tawag dyan, sayang. <laughs> Kasi hindi mo pwede benta yung puto. <laughs> Diba? So, tsaka ayaw mong tumanggap ng regalo na may putol. Feeling mo may kagat. Diba? Okay. So, bake nyo to at 350 degrees for uh, about 30 minutes. And then, you will come up with something like this. Okay? It's just a thin bar. Kung gusto nyo mas makapal, then you can double the recipe and cook it longer. And bake it longer, I mean. Okay, and then, now, we're going to put caramel topping. Okay? This one is just a caramel candy that you can buy from the grocery. So, for that size, I started melting about mga 20 pieces of caramels. Okay, kung medyo matigas, you can add uh, one to two tablespoons of butter. Okay, so once your caramels, ito yung candy caramels lang na nabibili sa grocery. Once it's completely melted, ganyan ng texture, you have to put it on top of your uh, butterscotch bar right away na kaya kong hawakan ng isang kamay. Okay, so pour it on top. Okay, and then you just spread it. Yan. Mabilis siya mag-set. So, please, uh, try to spread it fast. Yan. I'm going to put on top, okay, para maiba naman yung ating butterscotch bars for this season, ang Franklin Baker Tender Flakes. I'm going to put it on top while the caramel is warm para dumikit. Okay, don't forget the corners. And then, put chopped walnuts. Yan. So, put it on top. Okay, and then, press down. Okay? So, it sticks to the bar. So, there. And then, you let it cool lang just a little bit so you can set the caramel. Okay? And this is the trick. What you have to do, once it's cool, this is how you cut. Okay, press down. Para hindi mag-messy, you have to pull it sa side. Okay? And then, yung mga dumidikit, you have to take it out. Don't put it back sa iyong bars. Okay? You can cut this like, you know, uh, for at a time. But since I have some that I've already cut, I'll just cut like a piece. Yan. So, an 8 by 8 can make you about 16 bars. Okay? So, pwede mo siya lagay sa paper cup. Para easy handling. Like this. I'm preparing this so I can share this with Sam and Ronald. And of course, Eileen. Sam, Ronald, me, and Eileen. <laughs> and of course, I have a whole plate for everybody to look at. fair share of butterscotch bars, but this is really special. Mm -hmm. You really went all out because it's Christmas. Yes, and it's different. Try mo sa for you to know yung effect ng salt sa Oh, that's right. Ako rin try ko. Try mo, Chef Jackie. Mmm. Hindi ka naman nagtatry, Ronald. It's so crap. They kind of like it that it's still warm. Diba? Mmm. It's the way it's good. Mm. Is that the salt? Yeah. That's the salt. Ayun pala yun. Mm -hmm. And of course, naging um, healthier yung butterscotch since we're using the fountain baker and the fresh picks. That's right. I did not put butterscotch and coconut together, but it works beautifully. Mm -hmm. Then my walnuts pa. Mm -hmm. Which is also healthy. Correct. Okay, oh, inin mo na to, Chef Jackie. Of Sayang. Course. <laughs> <laughs> Come to 
the World Entrepreneur Business Expo on November 20 at the SMX Convention Center for the Ferna Food Service Demonstration and pick up new ideas and skills to succeed in the food business.